Well, hello, everybody. Welcome to Monday. Uh, today was a really interesting day, actually, altogether. Uh, the S&P 500 ended up down a little bit more than 0.4%, uh, but it was a, quite a wild ride today. At the very open, it was up quite a bit. Uh, the first vaccines were given out, and there was some excitement there. That was followed up with some information about the uh, uh, proposed stimulus package getting a little bit closer. Things are looking great. Then all of a sudden, we started seeing kind of some drop downs and Really, if you go back and look, the, uh, the mayor of New York City came out and said that they were going to be looking at further lockdown uh, features. And you can really tell where the stock market is located uh, when there's bad news in New York City. Sometimes that affects the market. A few weeks ago, uh, the market dropped a bit after the mayor announced that they were going to be closing the school. So luckily, those things are super temporary uh, and they don't really uh, you know, seem to have a big impact. But sort of, you know, the story of today was uh, around the lockdowns in general. So, for example, United was down 3.4 percent. You know, they need people out there to make money. Uh, and Amazon was up 1.3 percent today. Again, people staying home order more through Amazon. So uh, that's the story of what's happening. Luckily for us today, uh, almost every single one of our target indexes and individual stocks did better than the S&P 500 today. Uh, so, you know, clean energy was, uh, were up 1.3 and 0.8. Our cybersecurity is up 1.1, our you know, online retail up 0.7, et cetera. So um, we have a portfolio that is very well adapted to any situation that can come so far. So for example, if they start talking about lockdowns, you know, we've got those pieces. We have online retail, we have those components that are doing. If they start talking about the vaccine really working, you know, we'll start to see those value stocks uh, really start to come up. And we've got that now in the portfolio too. So you know, advanced healthcare, uh, the technology, especially innovative type technology, online retail, uh, and the, you know, um, clean energy and the value. So, you know, we're rounding this out uh, and we've seen some pretty consistent returns come out of that. So very happy with that. Uh, I think things are still in play. You know, next year is about the vaccine that works. It releases the, you know, pent up demand and you've got zero interest rates possibly throughout the year. Uh, which really creates a scenario where a lot of money starts to come out. So, you know, we'll see how that plays out, but that's that's a possible theme uh, that we have to watch for. So um, today was interesting. Uh, I do think it kind of, you know, will be a bit of a temporary thing uh, when we have these downturns right now. There's a lot, a lot of money coming in off the sidelines that keeps pushing this thing forward. So let's see what happens uh, tomorrow and, and, and for the rest of this week. I'll talk to you then. Thank you.